so now you will be confused in last minute with to study whether to study previous year papers or do revision. Don't worry we're here to help you by powerful tricks. Never get nervous while going to KCET exam and while preparing for the exam. So always be confident. Hello everyone in today's video let's see how to take more marks in KCET without studying. It's my responsibility to tell everyone about safety measures against the two new viruses named Delta virus and the newly arrived Zika virus and please follow the COVID-19 safety guidelines provided by the government. So be careful with the new virus coming from monkeys named monkey B virus. So this tricks are only for emergency purposes and please don't misuse this tricks this tricks will be even more good if you have some basic knowledge about the syllabus. So hard work good or smart work good there always a big clash between these two terms. But when you're participating in a competitive exam along with hard work smart work very important. In KCET exam 40 percentage from first PUC and 60 percentage from second a PUC. As we all know the total marks for KCET for 180 marks. So according to KCET you have provided 1 minute for each questions which in terms means you have got 60 questions for 60 minutes. Which turns to be 60 minutes equal to 1 hour. KCET wants you to solve each question very faster in snap of seconds like Thanos. Welcome everyone this is AVEA let's get into the video. So how to get more marks in KCET exam without studying. Probability tricks valid for maths and chemistry do check our playlists. There are already videos uploaded for maths and chemistry do check that in our channel if you missed watch even that. In this question denominator of option 1 and 4th option are same. So the answer must be between these two options. So now to decide the correct answer we will take the help of other options. Option 2 supports option 1 by having the same numerator so the correct answer will be first option. If you're solving without tricks then imagine how much you have to do so you can verify your answer here. In this question denominator 12 being common for both the options first and option second. So the answer might be between these two options. So now to find the correct answer between these two options. We take help from the question. In the question there being a hint given number 60 so now 12 into 5 gives 60. Then taking 12 into 5 on other side it becomes 5 by 12. So therefore the final correct answer will be first option. If you're solving without tricks then imagine how much you have to do so you can verify your answer here. In this question the probability of option 1 being the answer very low, since option 1 not having any similarities, so then the correct answer must be among the three remaining options. The alphabet R being common in all the three options so then to find the correct answer we take help from the other options. In the numerator Q square not being repeated in any option so probability of second option. Being correct being very low. So we can easily eliminate the second option. So in the third option there being a minus sign and the probability of minus sign being repeated in remaining other options. So this gives the probability of third option being correct. So if you have guessed third option then appreciate yourself you're a genius. Because the correct answer being the third option. If you're solving without tricks then imagine how much you have to do so you can verify your answer here. If you need the book which I have used in this video you can buy that the buying link given below in the description you can buy that if you have suggestions to our channel you can comment that. And you can tell me what kind of videos you need. If you need more tricky videos like this you can tell that in comment. If you have any doubts you can also contact in or Instagram ID, the Instagram. Link is given below. Don't stress out chill with your exams practice more the previous year papers. For now this AV Arvind signing off. All the best for your exams. Take care of your parents thank you. Namaskar and Vanakam.